and welcome to our Year with the Ears, our daily vlog where we relive our year living in the Walt Disney World Resorts in 2019. Today is day 120. We have a lot going on in the next week or so, and so today we decided to just take it easy and hang out at the resort, have kind of a relaxing day. I did have a couple work calls scheduled and a little bit I had to get done, but nothing too crazy, and I figured all of that can be done if I'm poolside. So we got ready and headed out to the quiet pool here at Polynesian, which I honestly like better than the main pool because it's mm -hmm. quieter. I really like how relaxing and calm it is over there. You have the music in the background and generally it's not very loud except maybe one or two kids sometimes that are being loud, but nothing compared to the main pool where they have music going and they have the waterfall and the water slide and all this other stuff going on. So we spent the entire morning and afternoon out there by the pool working, swimming, a little bit of both. I had my calls out there as well and just enjoying being here at this resort. It really is just relaxing to be on Disney property anyway, but the Polynesian is just a very relaxing resort overall. All the theming, the music, the vibe, we just love it so much and we've really enjoyed being here. And we're just enjoying having a relaxing resort day. Nothing scheduled, nothing specific going on, so we just enjoyed a vacation day today. Around dinner time, we decided to go see what they had at Captain Cook's and we saw pulled pork nachos. We're like, that sounds good, nice and light. We've been in the hot sun all day, so we don't want to eat anything super heavy after that. We're like, we can share these. We'll see how they are. And I wasn't sure I actually wanted these. Oh my goodness. These pulled pork nachos were incredible. We both loved them so much. We're like, okay, this is a must have next time we come back. We're definitely getting these again because they were delicious. So far, we haven't had anything bad here in Polynesian, though. Yeah, the food at the Quick Service and over at Trader Sam's, mm -hmm. and then, of course, upstairs at Ohana and Kona. Just so many great options here at Polynesian, and the pulled pork nachos are still, to this day, one of yes. my favorite things to get there because they have pulled pork on top, and they also have pineapple, and it's just mm -hmm. such a great combination. After dinner, we took a walk around the resort. This is the perfect time to walk around any resort at Disney mm -hmm. because it's around sunset, it's not as hot as the middle of the day, but it's still not kind of cool in the evening. So I really enjoy the beautiful views you get because sunsets in Florida are incredible, but sunsets at Disney World are even better because of just your surroundings and everything. So we walked around, talked for a bit. We noticed the quiet beach had a really nice view of what we assumed would be the fireworks later this evening in Cinderella Castle. And so we went and asked a cast member, do they pipe in the music on the beach over there? They said, yes, we do pipe in the music on the quiet beach. So if you want to head over there and watch it tonight, you can. We're like, this will be perfect. We don't have to be around the huge crowd. This will be so much nicer. So we decided to go live on Facebook that night to show the electrical water pageant. And of course it was just as fun as the first time we saw it or the hundredth time. We just love it. And then we noticed that the fireworks started for happily ever after. And there was again, no music. Mm -hmm. So I went to the lobby again. They said, oh, I'm so sorry. We don't pipe in music on the quiet beach over there. You have to go to the main beach. And I'm like, oh, okay. So I went back and Robert's filming. I told him, he's like, okay. So we're live on Facebook, walked all the way over there, get to the main beach. And there was no music. Yeah. I was like, really? So I went back to the lobby and he's like, really no one has said anything at this point we're like five minutes into happily ever after he's like no one has come in and told us i was like there's no music out there i went to a couple different speakers nothing he goes i am so sorry i don't know why we're struggling so much and the next thing i know i see a manager out there going from speaker to speaker just like trying to listen to see if anything's coming out if they need to turn it up there was nothing there was no music again so Robert took the stream and went over to the green area and just kind of watched it from there. And a few people were singing the songs for Happily Ever After and we all just kind of watched it in almost silence, which was awesome. So again, we got to see Happily Ever After without music and this is becoming a theme here apparently. And hopefully next time we stay here at Polynesian, they'll have the speakers working and we can actually enjoy <laughs> the music with the fireworks. I don't know, they were just, they were really struggling these they last were. couple days. That's okay, we'll try it again next time we come back. We headed back to the room after we ended our live stream and that was the end of our day today. So we'll see you tomorrow for our year with the ears.